very first hot box. So this is our very first top box, and top box is a subscription um, box, obviously, that comes monthly, and it is targeted towards how old your puppy is. Targeted towards Scar, which he is five months old. When you open it up, there's this, and I like this because, like, the top, you can put how many months he is. Um, and his measurements, his weight, and all that, and you could like take a picture, kind of like if you were taking a baby's picture. And inside, there are two papers, and this one says, let's play some games, and it gives you like some ideas of games to do with your puppy. And then this one is different milestones that your dog meets um, at five months old. So it says training and development for your five month old puppy. So where is my sweet puppy and who is this monster? Um, and like kind of like information that will happen at this stage. Handling exercises for you and the baby and puppy health and nutrition. So I really enjoyed reading this and I found it very interesting. Um, guidelines was like be your puppy's guide, maintain clear rules and boundaries. Practice self-control skills, leash skills, and avoid frustration. In this box, there was two toys and two treats. And then also, there was this water bottle. Um, I opened this box a couple weeks ago, didn't get the chance to film it, but I have used this on every single trail walk that we have gone to. So we sometimes go to the waterfront and... Um, before we go for our hike, I will fill this up and like pour it in. It's come in like a lot of use, especially after hikes, because you don't want to be carrying around like a bowl and filling that with water. That's kind of messy. I'm sorry, he destroyed the tank. But in this was the dinosaur or a dragon, and it has a squeaker. It says made to last stronger and last longer. I guess like the material is supposed to be stronger. I honestly don't think this will last that long because a lot of plush toys for Scar do not last that long. But he seems to like it. Come on. Oh, sit. Good boy. The next thing that was in here is a rope, bone, and tug, which is this. Um, this morning, actually, he ended up tearing apart two of these. So I'm not too sure if I like rope toys that much. I know like you're supposed to supervise your dog and stuff and play tug of war. But personally, I think playing tug of war with him makes him more aggressive. And I don't want like him to become more aggressive. So if I'm teaching him now that it's okay to be aggressive and play tug of war at five months, then what's going to happen when he's older, maybe a year or two old? He's going to think it's okay to be aggressive. So in my opinion, I would hold off on these tug of war toys because I think that if I'm teaching him now that it's okay to tug and pull on fabrics and stuff, then he's going to continue to do that. The next thing are the two treats. So this one is trail mix, and as you can see, there's banana pieces in it, um, which I like. It says with kale, apples, blueberries, and bananas. This is made in the USA. Sorry, I forgot to mention that this box is from the state. It's by the brand Treat Simple. It says no wheat, non-GMO, corn-free, and soy-free. No added salt, sugar, or preservatives. <laughs> the ingredients are oat flour, blueberries, kale, apples, bananas, coconut oil, and honey. So I do like this, but oat flour being the first ingredient obviously means that there's the most of that. Um, I do wish there was like some sort of protein in this. The next treat is all natural grain free um, creme de menthe, which is spinach, apples, and mint. Some. Its ingredients are spinach, chickpea, and potato flowers, apples, mint, rosemary, and olive oil. So I guess you could say like overall these treats are healthy, but like I said, I wish there was more protein involved in them. So I guess he likes the um, squeaker toy from it. But it honestly seems like it's already coming apart, like, right here. What's wrong? Do you like 
with your toy. But yeah, so that was our butt box, and we really enjoyed it. As I mentioned in my last video, I do like one ingredient treats that are more protein based and more meat based. Um, I also think it's very important to add like natural foods to your dog's food. So sometimes, like as treats, I will give him, I'll give him carrots. I also give him fresh blueberries. And honestly, I think adding fruits and vegetables to your dog's food is very beneficial for their health in the future and even now. Um, but yeah, that's just my opinion. We really like this box. I think my favorite thing out of this box and any box that I've gotten is this water bottle thing. Um, I honestly haven't seen one at any of the stores I've gone to. But yeah, I really enjoyed it. I've used it multiple times and it's probably one of my favorite things that I've gotten in any box. I know it's not like a toy or a treat for the dog, but it, it has been very beneficial and helped me a lot. So that's everything. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and see you next time. Bye.